In this video we are going to learn how to add two layers and three layers of fraction binary number. In our previous video we have seen that how to add two binary digits 0 plus 0 gives 0, 0 plus 1 1, 1 plus 0 1 and 1 plus 1 gives us 0 as sum and 1 as carry. And why it is like this that we have learned in our previous video and if you are interested in exploring that thing in detail I recommend you to watch that video after this one. So now here we are going to add two fraction binary numbers 111.11101.10. So our addition will start with the rightmost column of the fraction part. This is our fraction part and this is our whole number part. So the rightmost column of the fraction number part is this one. So from this place our addition will start. So 1 plus 0 is 1. When we add 1 plus 1 the sum is 0. The carry to the next column will be 1. But now here the next column will be in whole number part. So we'll add 1 as a carry in whole number part. And now we'll start adding this column. But before that there is a point. So we'll place a point in the summation. And now we'll start adding this column. So 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and the carry is 1 to the next column. Now 0 plus 1 gives us 1. And then after we'll move towards the next column. 1 plus 1 the sum will be 0 and carry is 1 to the next column and when we add 0 plus 0 the summation will be 0. Now let's jump to the next column. Let's add 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carry is 1 to the next column. 0 plus 1 gives us 1 and now finally the final carry. Now there is no digit left in these two numbers so we'll bring down this carry as it is 1. So 1101.01 is the final answer of this fractional binary addition. It might be confusing for you that why it is like this when we add 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carries 1 to the next column. If it is confusing then the detailed explanation of this logic is provided in my previous video. I request you to watch that previous video. The link of that video is in description and above we are in i button. So you can check that video after this one. Now let's jump for the three layer of addition and over there you will find something interesting and new in addition. So now let's go for the three layer addition. So in three layer addition also we'll start with the rightmost column which is this one. So 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carry to the next column is 1. 0 plus 1 the sum is 1. Now we'll place a point over here and then we'll move to the next column. Let's add these two 1. So 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 carries 1 to the next column. 0 plus 1 is 1 and 1 plus 0 is 1. So the sum is 1. Now it's time for the next column. 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 carries 1 to the next column. 0 plus 0 is 0 and that 0 plus 1 is 1. Now it's time for this column. 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 carries 1 to the next column. 0 plus 1 the sum is 1. And 1 plus 1 again the sum is 0 and carries 1 to the next column. Now here there are two carries but no digit left in this numbers. So what we'll do? We'll start adding these two carries. 1 plus 1 the sum is 0 and carries 1 to the next column. So now here you can see we have one carry but no digit left in any of the number. So what we'll do? We'll directly bring this carry down. And the final answer becomes like this 10011.1. So that's how you can add three layers of fraction binary addition. Like binary addition, binary subtraction is also really interesting to learn. So to clear your concept about binary subtraction, watch out this video. And here you can see a two numericals of fraction binary addition is given to you for your self practice. Calculate it right now and write the answer in comments to check whether your answer is correct or not. After commenting in answer, let's jump to the binary subtraction. So see you into that video.